Hey guys, whoo! You might have thrusters, but you ain't got nada till you've had my chipotle chicken frittata. Go ahead and gather these ingredients. One pound ground chicken. 12 eggs in a cage. Three slices bacon, chopped. Three roasted yams. Two yellow onions. Four poblano peppers. Two cups sun-dried tomatoes. Five large tomatoes. Four bunches cilantro. One lime. One serrano. Two cloves garlic. We're gonna start off with our bacon and a preheated cast iron skillet. Get that going there, we're gonna render that fat and that'll provide the cooking agent for our chicken, our veggies. From there I'm gonna add my gaga garlic and then kind of move our bacon to one side, let that cook. Season side down on this into the pan and then our seasoning on top. There we'll kind of start breaking this up. I'm still gonna keep these guys separate at this time so we can get the bacon crisp up, kind of caramelize a little bit. And then we'll attend to our veggies here. Get my onion going. Boom, there we go. All right, we'll pull some of the bacon fat over into this area of the pan and add our onion. A little salt on there. Then we'll hit our poblanos. Poblanos are done, we're gonna get those in the pan. And then our tomatoes. Now we're gonna prep our yams. And by that, I just, uh, all I'm gonna do is peel them and cut them into slices. And this is essentially gonna make a bottom layer or a crust for our frittata. I'll cut these into slices about three quarters of an inch thick. And then I'll place these in the bottom of a baking dish. We're looking good on our skillet here, guys. This stuff's right about where I want it. I'm gonna cut the heat on that and I'm gonna show you guys how to crack some eggs quickly. What I do is I set up my eggs here, container here, garbage can right here. I'm gonna use one hand to pass the eggs to the other hand. Crack, boom, pass, crack. Don't worry too much about the shell. The little membrane inside the shell is gonna hold these together. So you're, you're better off just kind of getting after it instead of being very cautious about the shell. We can always pick shells out at the end. From there, I'm gonna grab an immersion blender, just blitz this up quick. Boom, we're ready to go. We'll transfer our mixture to our baking pan. And then we'll just pour our eggs over the top. Just like that, it's gonna go in the oven. We're gonna say 375 for about 20 to 30 minutes. I'm gonna do that now and then I'll give you guys an update on exactly how long it took and what it looks like when it's done. In the meantime, we're gonna make our salsa roja. We'll be right back. For our salsa roja or salsa chipotle, we're gonna start with our tomatoes. We're just going whole tomatoes in a saucepan. Let's kind of press these garlic cloves with our palm. And then our serrano, I'm gonna take the seeds out of that. We'll turn that on high and then let it boil until the tomatoes soften. Okay, the tomatoes are ready. I kind of break them up a little bit here with my tongs. I'll transfer them into here so you guys can kind of see what the immersion blender does to them. So we'll cut the heat there. And then we'll go in with this guy. So you can see there's plenty of water in the tomatoes to, to give us a liquid. And now I'm gonna add my chipotle to this. Pinch of salt. And then we'll finish with our lime. Here we are, guys. All done. This is what we're looking for. A nice, crispy, kind of caramelized crust up top. The eggs set throughout. This I'm estimating at about 24 blocks, so I'm gonna cut it into eight three blockers. Here we have it, it's our three block chipotle chicken frittata. It's a great way to start your day strong. Boom! Get out there, give it a try. I gotta get back to those thrusters. We'll see you next week.